Hey tech enthusiasts, welcome back to Fast Cabling. Today, we're talking about how you can bring blazing fast internet speed to every home with something called passive optical networks. Pawn. Now, whether it's for family bench watching Netflix, a gamer who needs low latency action, or someone working from home, Pawn delivers the speed and reliability needed to keep everyone connected. And if you need help to set up your Pawn network or any other tech project, we're offering free tech consultation. So just send us your questions through the link down in the description box below, and our team of experts will get back to you as soon as possible. So high-speed internet is no longer a luxury, it is a necessity. With the rise of streaming, online gaming, and remote work, more families and tenants need internet that just work without buffering or lag. So that's where Pawn comes in, providing fast, reliable, and efficient internet right into your home. So now let's dive into how it works. Now imagine Pawn as a tree. Now at the base of the tree, you've got the trunk. So this is called the optical line terminal, OLT. So it's the main connection to your internet provider. And from the trunk, you have branches extending outwards. So these are optical network units, the ONUs, which deliver the internet to individual homes. Pretty simple, right? The optical line terminal, the OLT, sends out light signals. Yes, light through fiber optic cables. These signals are split into a multiple stream using something called PLC splitter. And those streams are sent directly to the ONUs at home. So just like a tree provides nutrients to every leaf, Pawn delivers high-speed internet to multiple homes from a single source. Efficient, eco-friendly, and perfect for today's data-heavy household. And it's cost-effective because it uses passive components with no need for power equipment between the main connection, the OLT, and the homes, the ONUs, making installations and maintenance easy. And with straightforward installation and minimal upkeep, Pawn is an excellent solution for home internet, offering performance and reliability. So now we're in front of the demonstration board. Let's talk about the key players in this setup. First, we've got the optical line terminal, the OLT. This is your main connection to the internet. And next up, we have the PLC splitter. Now, this splitter can split one optical signal into multiple ones, so it can be distributed to several homes. And as you can see, no power needed. Finally, we have the optical network unit, the ONU. Now, think of this as the gateway that brings the internet inside the home where it connects to your router for Wi-Fi access. Or you can just use our Wi-Fi ONU to provide high-speed internet for the entire household. And don't worry, installation is easier than you might think. Now let's go through a step-by-step -step guide on how to install a PON network. So we should start by connecting your OLT to the PLC splitter. So this is our OLT, the optical line terminal, and this is the PON port. We are going to use the connector here so we can connect with the fiber optic cable. Today we are using this two-string pre-made fiber optic cable, so we don't need to worry about the connector just plug and play, and we can use string A directly to the palm port and use an ethernet cable to connect to the RJ45 ethernet port for internet access. So now we will connect it to our PLC splitter. This is where the main internet signal is split into multiple streams. And as you can see, this is a passive device that means no power source needed, so it's super safe and easy to handle. So those are the input port. This is a 2 times 32 splitter. That means it can receive 
to input for redundancy or backup. So here's our fiber optic cable. Remember, we use string A. Let's plug it into the input port. So we can split it up to 32 different household. So just randomly pick one. And from our splitter, we can run individual fiber optic cable to each home's ONU. And then inside the home, we can connect the ONU to your router and set up the Wi-Fi, or you can just use our Wi-Fi ONU. Now this is the all-in-one device that brings fiber optic internet into your home and distribute it to your devices wirelessly. So here's the fiber optic cable. Let's plug it into the palm port and turn it on so we can get internet access. So it's that simple. You've now set up a passive optical network that can serve multiple homes with high-speed internet. Now, what if you live in a remote area? You can use Starlink to beam internet to a central hub, then use Pawn to distribute it to multiple homes. This can be a game changer for rural communities. But be sure to check the Starlink policies before setting up any pawn splitters with their service. Now, here are a few tips to make sure you are getting the fastest and most reliable internet possible with pawn. Make sure your ONU is up to date to handle the highest possible speeds. Position your router in a central location. Use the 5 GHz band for faster speed and minimize interference from other devices. And if you're facing slow speed, you can check for network congestion or make sure your ONU is properly connected. And you can also tweak your Wi-Fi setting to ensure you're getting the best performance. And with these tips, now you can enjoy buffer-free streaming, smooth gaming, and reliable work-from-home connections. So to wrap things up, Passive optical networks bring fast, reliable, and efficient internet to homes by splitting a single fiber connection into multiple streams. It's easy to install and it's the perfect solution for today's data-hungry world. And if you're looking to upgrade your home's internet setup, Pawn might be the way to go. Now, thank you very much for watching. Before you go, please don't forget to like, subscribe and hit the bell icon for more tech tips and tutorial and i'll see you in our next video